A key inflation report out today is affecting your 401k, your investments. The stock markets closed just about eight minutes ago. This is the headline right now on CNBC. The Dow closing 400 points lower today as a hot consumer inflation report incites a sell-off. I want to show you the closing numbers up here. The Dow Jones down 422 points. That's a 1% loss. The S&P 500 also down about a percent here. Same thing for the NASDAQ, down 136 points. This, of course, coming after this big inflation news today and the and concerns about those in big interest rates that we keep seeing here. Dan, we'll send it back to you for more on that. Yeah, we'll stay on that topic, Matt. Thank you. Prices did jump 3.5% last month. That's according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics. Gas prices and higher housing costs fueled the surge in the prices, as we're seeing. They accounted for more than half of last month's increase. The surge calling into question whether the Fed will cut interest rates again. President Biden says overall inflation is much better than it was. We have dramatically reduced inflation from 9% down to close to 3%. We're in a situation where we're better situated than we were when we took office, where we, inflation was skyrocketing, and we have a plan to deal with it. Grocery prices stayed flat month to month, but they are up compared to last year. Depending on what you bought, the price hike might have been even higher. Coming up at 4.30, a closer look at the more direct effects of last month's inflation surge.